Hi everyone, welcome back. And to those of you who are new here, I'm Melody. Now let's get into this haul. I went to Daiso, and actually this is a this is like a two trip for me. Like I've been there on two trips. First off, I'd like to start with this item. This is one of my favorites. It works really great on mirrors and windows. I know that a lot of us already have these e-cloths, but the e-cloths don't really work really well for me. A lot of times I still see streaks or little pieces of fabric on it, but um, this guy here really gets it clean. It's kind of like a, I don't know how you describe this. It's kind of like a, like a, not really a jelly, but it's like a chamois cloth almost, but it's not chamois. You just damp it and then you squeeze out all the water and then you can just wipe it. And pretty much almost every time I get a streak free clean. So this is the first time I picked up. When they do dry out, they are hard and crispy, but you just have to run it under water and then it gets soft again. And as you can see here, a certain somebody's have gotten to it. My cat, she eats everything. So I just fold it up and then I set it aside and I let it dry hard like that. And then when I'm ready to use it, I just rinse it. Next up, I love their room socks. Dollar Tree socks aren't bad, but sometimes they're a little short in the ankle and they fall off my feet. And I do wear socks when I'm sleeping. So I picked up three pairs. This one here looks like little cat paws. These were $1.75. The cleaning cloth was also $1.75. And then here's the third pair I picked up. This one has hearts on it. I picked up this, it's a straw brush, you know, to clean your straws. I had one, but again, a certain somebody who eats everything had chewed on it while I was drying it. So I, <laughs> I needed a new one. And it, it comes with two. It has this, well, let me open it up for you so you can see better. So it comes with two and they actually have it. Can you guys see that? It has a ring so you can keep it together so you don't lose them. So it has this bigger one and then it has this smaller one. These were $1.75. The next item is for this. <laughs> I currently don't have anything to pour my olive oil in, so I've been using it, you know, from this giant thing. I think it's going to work better if I put it in this. And I thought for $1.75, this wasn't bad. It's an, it's like a, a, they call it a sauce bottle. It has this little topper here. Whoa. It has this little topper here. It's kind of a, it's like a little rubbery type thing. It says it holds 17.24 ounces or 510 mLs. This is a glass bottle. So I just remove this. I want to create a label for it with my Cricut, but that's, you know, for another project some other day. So, It'll be a little, e it'll be a little easier using it from this than this, you know, and I probably won't be so heavy handed with it. Next, we have this item here. It's a box cutter. Let me open that for you. I currently use my scissors to open boxes, but I thought it would be nice to have something like this just for boxes. You can change the blade out by removing the bottom. Although I was in Dollar Tree today and they do smell, ugh, smell, you sell smaller versions of these and you can get them in a three pack. This was $1.75. Gidget, you're gonna, you're gonna help me? Okay, there we go. That's what happened. All right. I picked this up. I was on Temu's website and I saw that they had a two pack. It has a glare, so let me take it out of the box. Okay. I was on Temu's website and I noticed that they had a two pack of these. And I was like, well, I want one of those, but I don't want two. So I thought I'd check out Daiso and sure enough, they had it. For $1.75, I was able to grab one. So I plan on putting my olive oil in here because I do a lot of air frying and then I can 
what are we saying? What are we trying to say, Gidget? I plan on putting my olive oil in here so we can then, you know, spread it on and do the thing. Excuse me. We're not doing so good today, are we good? Next up, I bought this. This was $6.25 and it's one of those containers that folds. Can you guys see that okay? And it has these handles. And it's got the Toy Story. It's got the Toy Story logo on it. I actually have a few of these in my car and they work really great. Not this brand. I bought them at Sam's and Costco. But man, they're so convenient. I mean, if you go to Aldi, you can just carry this with you or set it in your cart and put your stuff in there. So easy. And then it folds up really easy too. This was $6.25. Okay, next up, this is something for my cat. She loves paper bags and tunnels. So I thought for $1.75, yeah, it was $1.75. I thought I could pick this up for her. It's like a paper bag tunnel. Let's take a look at it. Oh, it literally is just a paper bag tunnel. Here's what it's supposed to look like. Okay, I'm not sure how these are gonna work. These were $1.75 as well. She's starting to scratch certain things. It's like a, like a film. Sorry about the glare. Let me take it out of the packaging so you can see that a little better. It's a film that you cut and you can apply to your furniture or whatever the item is. So I'm hoping, it says it's a scratch prevention sheet. I'm hoping this will help. Okay, I see. It has a film protector, it says, that you remove. Do you guys, can you guys see that? It has this film. And then it's got this sticky, it's got this sticky back here. So I can put that on my furniture. Fortunately, it's just one item and one area that she's doing this to. So hopefully this, is, this should be enough. Here are the dimensions in case you didn't see. Okay, next up, this. I couldn't resist it. It's a Winnie the Pooh lap blanket. Here are the dimensions here. This was also $6.25. Okay, this is perfect for like, this is actually a good size uh, blanket for the car. You know, it's not too big, so it won't be too bulky and you can keep it in there. On this side here, it has like this little, kind of like a faux furry type material. So it's, and it's not super thin either. It's, I mean, it's thin, but it's not like paper thin. It has this saying on it. So I want to read it to you. It's kind of weird. It says, such very good friends. That's tickling me. No worries. No bothers. Just fun. <laughs> time spent together is time well spent. Sharing special moments. Who, who, who. Well, it's cute. <laughs> <laughs> the tickling me part. I don't know why. That's just <laughs> you gotta keep your hands off me, buddy. <laughs> oh yeah, see here's Eeyore. How cute. And then it's got oh look. So here's some of the designs on it. It's a really cute blanket. Even with the saying, and I don't think the saying's too bad. I don't know why I thought it was funny. Okay, let's move on. <laughs> oh. Okay, couldn't resist these. They have a Hello Kitty section in there. 
sometimes it's good, sometimes it's not so good. But today they had these pill, let me just take it. I don't know why I'm leaving it in the, let me take it out. They had these pill boxes. I say today, I wasn't there today. I went there yesterday. Okay, they have these pill boxes. It's still kind of, can you guys see that okay? for vitamins and stuff i already have one but i love it so much it's a different version one i bought a year ago but i love it so much that i was like oh if it breaks i won't have a new i won't have one and i'll be sad so i saw these and i was like yes i got another one a dollar 75 for this i picked up two because they had two versions this one's a little different isn't that cute? My Melody is my favorite, of course, because we share the name. And then, and then, it, oh, this one just opens up all the way like this. And it has a few of these you can remove. So this is set in there, but these you can move. Oh, what did I do there? These you can move. I couldn't resist these. These come in so, so handy, especially when traveling, you know, not just for not just for medications, but for anything really. Next, we have this silicone mug cover. I have a couple of these, but this one seemed, I don't know, it seemed a little larger and that's what I want. I could be wrong about that. You know, things look different in the store and then you bring them home and you're like, well, what was I thinking? But you just put it over your mug. Let me grab a mug and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so I grabbed this mug. So you just, please, please ignore the watermarks on it. You put it over your, your drink, whatever you've got in there, and then you just put it here. And it actually does help to keep the steam in there. And I do really feel like it keeps the tea, you know, if it's a hot tea, a little warmer. It also keeps cat's paws out of it too, by the way. So I just put that on top. And as you can see, this is a little larger than... A, than like a, a mug. Well, let me try it on my Ray Dunn mug. Let me see. Okay, here's my Ray Dunn mug that I like to use. And it it's a good fit. It actually, you can see it covers the whole top. Because, you know, these are a little larger. So that's what I was wanting. And it actually gives you a little bit of suction too. Oh, look at that. I wouldn't recommend doing that though. But yeah, these are great. $1.75. Just two more items to go. This one here, it's like a plastic grip mat. It's a plastic liner. I paid $1.75 for this. It says it's got like a, a non-slip grip. I plan on using this in the master bath inside the cabinet where we keep our laundry basket and some cleaning supplies. I need to repaint that area, but I wanna lay this on the floor underneath where I have the cleaning supplies and the laundry basket. I wanted a waterproof surface for it once I've painted it. So there's that. And that is, how big is that? It's 11.8 inches by 34, oh, 35.4 inches. There we go. Last up, this is actually a gift for a family member. And, ta-da, isn't that cute? It's got a lid. It doesn't, it doesn't have handles though, but still, it's got a lid. And this was, this was only $4.25. When I saw this, I was like, oh, I know she's gonna want this. I need to text her, make sure. But yeah, $1.75, or not $1.75, $4.25. Isn't that great? And it's pretty, I mean, pretty deep too. Like, you know, see. Does that help you guys? Probably not. Oh, here we go. Does it have dimensions? Oh, it does, but it's really small. Can you guys see that? Okay, so 10 inches by eight. Well, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider subscribing and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.